सो इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव डिस्कस हाउ कैन क्रिएट ए ब्लॉगर वेबसाइट एंड सबमिट इन सर्च कंसोल एंड क्रिएट गूगल एनालिटिक्स अकाउंट सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस हाउ कैन कस्टमाइज दिस वेबसाइट फ्रॉम स्क्रैच सो बिफोर दैट लेट्स गो टू द ब्लॉगर डैशबोर्ड एंड लेट मी जस्ट ओपन ए ब्लॉग पोस्ट हियर सो यू कैन सेट ए टाइटिल सो मेक्स योर टू कीप द टाइटिल शॉर्ट एंड सिंपल लाइक इफ आई वॉन्ट टू सेट ए टाइटिल लाइक एस सी ओ देन आई कैन सिंपली टाइप लाइक वाट इज एस सी ओ एंड वाई इट इज इम्पोर्टेंट फॉर ब्लॉगर्स लाइक दैट एंड आई कैन सेट ए टाइटिल सो आई कैन सिंपली सिलेक्ट दिस टेक्सट एंड क्लिक ऑन हियर एंड आई कैन सिंपली सिलेक्ट दी हेडिंग सो हेडिंग बेसिकली दी एच टू टैग एंड सॉप हेडिंग इज दी एच थ्री टैग and you can also use the h4 text and for text i can set it to paragraph and let me just select this text and i can set it to heading and let me just make it a heading now make sure to keep your paragraph short so let me just click on enter and let's divide this paragraph into multiple sections so i can click on here and divide the paragraph further so let's go to this and let me just break it here now i can add a image in this blog post so let me just search for a image but make sure to create your own image using the tools like canva or photoshop so let me just quickly add a image from here so make sure to use the copyright free images so you can use the pixabay.com or onsplash.com so let me just copy this image here so i can simply download this image to my computer and i can then upload it here so let me just upload the image so for this i will click on the image section and i can click on upload from computer now i can choose files and i will go to the download folder and select the image now the image is uploaded i can simply select this and i will click on setting and i will set it to extra large and i can set a all text here so all text basically describe the image so i can simply describe this image like a landscape image and i can simply update it now let me just update this blog post and you can simply add this blog post into a category so for this i can create a category like blogging and hit enter and let me just click on labels so it has now created the blogging category now click on update and you can also set the permalink but before that let me just revert it to draft so in the draft section you can set the custom permalink so this is post to so i can set a custom permalink like what is seo like that and let me just publish this and let me just open the blog post so as you can see the permalink is now changed so make sure to keep the permalink short and here you have to upload your own images and make sure to keep it copyright free or you can create your own images using tools like canva and make sure to keep the paragraph short and use the proper heading structure like keep the important heading in h2 and then keep the less important topic in h3 or h4 you can also use the bullet points so let me just show you how you can do that let me just add a bullet point here so i can add a bullet point like list 1 and i can simply click on this icon bullet list and i will click on enter and i can add different text here and let me just update this 
and let me just refresh this page and as you can see the list is now added so in this way you can further customize your blogger blog post and let me just go to the home page and as you can see the image is now showing so in this way you can further customize your blog post now let's check how you can change this icon or you can change it with your logo so for this click on layout section so here you can manage your website so to change the logo image you can simply search for header logo and click on this icon and simply you can remove this so let me just remove this url and let me just save this now let me just refresh this page and as you can see now the website logo is changed now you can further customize your menu so this is the menu link so this is the link so you can change this link by clicking on this so i can change or delete this drop down so let me just delete it and i can add more pages here so i can type like about and i can add the about link here and let me just add more links like contact and i can add the link here so you can copy the link of the pages by going to this pages section and hover over this view icon and right click on it and simply copy this url then go to the layout section and simply click on the header menu and click on the edit item and you can change the url like this and click on save and let me just save this menu and let me just refresh this page and as you can see the menu is now changed and when i click on the about button it will redirect to the about us page so let me just go to the home page and let's check how can edit the sidebar so for this i will click on the layout section and i can simply delete this option or you can add more options so let me just delete this ads and let me just delete this about and let me just delete this subscribe us video so i can just click on it and i can simply click on remove and you can also hide this section so if you want to hide the category section or if you want to remove any pop popular post section then you can simply hide this by clicking on this button and let's click on save now let me just refresh this page and as you can see these are gone so let's create some categories so for this i will go to the post so let me just click on post one and i will create more categories so let me just set the category to seo and click on this level and as you can see now the seo category is added now let me just update this and let me just click on layout section and i will click on categories and i can tick all and click on save now let me just refresh this page and as you can see the categories is now added and you can visit the category by clicking on this button so it will add the blog post in that category and you can also further customize the footer section by let's go to the footer section here and this is the about us section so just click on here and you can change the caption text so this is the text so you can change the text here so let me just delete the text and i can add my own text here and you can also change the image let me just save this and you can also change the icon of the social media buttons so you can change the link of the social media icons by just clicking on this icon and you can change your own link here and we can also delete some social media icons from here and here you can change your own link
and you can also further add more categories or change the footer menu so this is the footer menu so you can change this footer menu by clicking on these pages so i hope you got the basic idea how to customize your blogger website and if you want to change the color of this website then you can simply go to the theme and here click on the customize button and here you can simply click on advance and here you can see a lot of options so let me just click on theme color and here you can change the color of your website so if i want to change the theme color to blue it will change the color to blue or i can change the color to red so let me just change it to blue and let me just scroll down and let me just change the title hover color to something like blue and tab background to blue now let me just click on here i can change the theme font or i can change the top bar color by clicking on this button and as you can see the top bar color is changed so you can further customize the blogger website by changing different menu and changing different color now let me just click on post style and let me just increase the title font size and i can increase the text font size so let me just open the blog post here so as you can see the font is not that big so we can increase the font size by increase the text font size here so let me just make it to 19 and let me just click on save now let me just refresh this page and as you can see the font is now increased so in this way you can further customize your website and make it look better so the home page link is not so let me just click on here so i can change the home page link by just clicking on the header menu and i can click on this icon and i can simply type forward slash and click on save now let me just refresh this page again and when i click on the home button it will redirect to the home page i hope you got the idea how to customize your blogger website and if you have any doubt regarding this then you can ask me in the comment section and i will see you in the next video thank you